In this video, we are going to go over a couple of word problems that use your ability to add integers. Let's roll into it. The first problem says the temperature in Edmonton starts at negative nine degrees Celsius and rises six degrees Celsius to the high temperature. What is the high temperature? So this is all about translating the situation. We start at negative nine, right? So that's the amount that we start at. We begin at negative nine. If we rise, we are adding six degrees Celsius onto that current temperature. So we add six. Now we're going to use our skills of understanding that when I add integers with opposite signs, we subtract those two numbers and keep the sign of the larger number. So I've got negative nine plus six. So mentally I'm doing nine minus six. That's not what I'm actually writing down on my paper, but I'm doing nine minus six is three. And the larger of the two numbers in terms of their distance from zero, well, negative nine is farther from zero, so we keep the sign of that larger number, that is negative three. So your final answer is the high temperature is negative three degrees Celsius. You can also check yourself with some number sense, just thinking, well, if I start at negative nine and I gain six, I will not have gotten out of the negatives, right? To get out of there, we'd have to add at least nine. So we'd still stay in the negatives. Cool stuff. Second word problem. A soccer player's heart rate starts at 60 BPM, beats per minute. It rises 75 BPM before decreasing by 30 BPM. What is the soccer player's current heart rate? Okay, so this problem is about following along and translating what we have as we go. So we start at 60 BPM, so we're gonna start there. It then says that the heart rate rises by 75, so I'm gonna add 75 BPM. And then finally, we will decrease by 30 BPM. We can either write that as minus 30, that's fine, or you could see that as plus a negative 30. So we add on a decrease of negative 30. So you could do that as this problem, or we could do it as 60 plus 75 minus 30. And we'll do both just to see it's the same problem. So the order of operations dictate that we do all of our addition and subtraction from left to right. That would be the addition here first. 60 plus 75 is 135. You're left with plus a negative 30. So here we had signs that were the same, so we add them and kept the sign that was positive. Here we're adding two numbers where they have opposite signs. The larger number is 135, so we know that we are going to have a positive result in the end, which is good. You wouldn't want to have a negative uh, heart rate. That would be really bad. So 135 plus a negative 30. Mentally, I'm really doing 135 minus 30, and I'll put that a little tinier so you know that that's not the work that I'm necessarily doing out. That is equal to 105 which would be beats per minute. And again, we keep the sign being positive because 135 is a larger number than negative 30. We could have done the problem this way as well and thinking of decreases subtraction, we'd add these 60 and, one, and 75 to get 135. And then normal old subtraction, 135 minus 30 is 105 beats per minute. So both are perfectly acceptable and great ways of solving these problems. I hope you enjoyed these word problems that go over how to add integers. I know I did.